And we're back by Ren's Evil. Yeah, we're back. I just can't wait till we find Mr. Jiggle. Mr. Oh, oh. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, uh, I hate that one. Uh, you still want me to send you the images? They're not good. That's why I haven't yeah. sent them. Yeah, please don't. <laughs> wait, oh. If I found a good one, I would have sent it already. But I haven't. Fair enough. And uh, thank you for not sending it. Thank you. Looks uh, like we can continue on this way. I have standards. I'm not gonna send you ugly looking ine. It has to be good quality ine. <sighs> Poor bastard. That's no way to go. Alright, your turn. Okay, uh caretaker's note. <clears throat> oh god. I woke up in the middle of the night once again. It's those awful sounds coming from the basement. The sounds of nails crawl, uh, clawing at the stone wall and writhing moans of, of curses. Uh, the man harbors enough hate to ruin... God damn, give me a second. Sorry about that. The, the mic to speech spell thing popped up on my PlayStation for some reason. Uh, go, go to the next page. Uh, once he, uh, once he once served the lord of the castle as the torturer, uh, like his father, his grandfather before him. It's one of the unsightly legacies left by the Salazar family. Uh, even among his family, he was special. He enjoyed his work wholeheartedly and had a talent for it. He was gifted at tor tormenting others. His ability, his ability soon attracted the master's interest. And when he took him into the dungeon... No, I can't write anymore. I won't. I don't want to recall what happens down there. My mind can't take it. It will break. That was another page. Oh, well, that was weird. That, that sounded like an ending. Yeah. Uh, I was ordered to attend to him, to feed him, dispose of the filth, all while listening to the wretched voices every night. I can't take it anymore. I've had enough. I will not tolerate one more night in this castle. I, I shall leave tomorrow. Go far away, where the voices won't reach my ears. That's this so guy. So I'm guessing that's him. Yeah. So I'm guessing the torturer dude is a mini boss. <gasps> the torturer dude. Do they keep animals down Are you not gonna fight the torturer guy? I am. Is he the blind? He's not the blind guy, right? Yeah. Oh, he is the blind guy? Well, the torture is Salazar. Oh! Damn, I am gonna fight him. Fair enough, fair enough. Ha. La muerte, la luz. <laughs> I genuinely didn't expect that. I was so shocked by that, I didn't even flinch. Oh hi- oh! God, he looks terrifying in this. Can't see me. <gasps> well, you can hear you! Ya. Talk? Why do you talk? You know what? Best thing to do would to be kill him now. Uh... Best thing, but he's gonna get out of that thing. Yeah, but we can, you know... Explosive mine arrows? I'll have mine arrows. Can't you craft them? Whoa! Whoa! Why oh. do you run instantly? Oh, don't hit the chain! You can shoot the chain, though. Yeah, I don't have any mines. Can't you craft them? No. 
Damn it. I'll have the uh, thing to craft it. Oh, shit. Explosives would be great now. But, to be a cheeky bastard, can you shoot an arrow at one of the chains just to see if that works? Uh, Not the yes. chain, but I'm wondering if I could just do this. Alright, that worked. You need to stick this hand into the wall. Did he just show his back to you again for free? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna take that. Fuck! Oh, you're good, you're good, you're good. He's still attacking the wall. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Got it! Yeah! We can cheese this fight. I cheese it, but I need to go with to get the arrows. Oh, he's coming over here. Just walk around him now. He has no reason to go back. Don't do that. I'd All aim right. for the chains again. But... Wait, I got a bear idea. How did I hear that one? But aim for the little star thing. I, that thing has mass. Oh wow. Come on, can you back? Got it. Yeah. Okay, got him. Yeah. Easy. Easy. This is so much easier than the last game. Oh, that's just because I knew about the crossbow, man. And last time, I didn't even know shit about that. I lost crossbow. Did I lose crossbow? No, no, that's no, not what I had. No, on the other side. Uh, did I lose some? I thought I had one, I thought I had one more than this. No, you I had more, right? It. Yeah. Oh. No, I'm not hurt. I had like 23. Yeah, uh, go to his body again? No, oh. wow! I really lost a fuck ton of those. I mean, worth it still, but Jesus. Why did you lose them, though? I don't fucking know. They're not showing the map, so I'm assuming they're gone, gone. Maybe open the thing. Maybe they'll pop up on the body again because half his body's out through the door. Maybe. Because I thought most of them were stuck in him. I guess that's it. Unless, uh, unless I, unless I had uh, exactly sixteen. No, you de you definitely had twenty three in the back. Yeah, so it's basically a loss of fuck ton. Why though? That's what I want to know. I don't know. Science? <laughs> well, it's bad science. Good science? I like good science. Good signs. Who are you? That Ashley. Yeah. Oh, it's... oh I thought I missed that. What happened down there? Nothing. You were right about the animals, though. Well, you still have plenty for like a small, like group of three. Group of three. Yeah, you can kill a group of three with 16. No, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, the crossbow, a crossbow really comes in handy. Yeah. It's just with the bigger groups, 16 ain't gonna cut it. No. Okay. No. I'm fine. Well, for now. Ah, oh, yeah, I see it, the thing. Then get to the thing. I'm gonna get to the thing. Sheesh. Don't get rush me. Faster. <laughs> Shoot it! It's those stupid tokens you never use. 
Yeah, I should really start using those. Wow. Look at all of this. It's not that impressive, Ashley. Well, it is a lot of stuff. It is, but I'm not gonna go wow. To be fair, I don't care about paintings. What's wrong with you? But everyone's buying stock in the paintings because it just all always goes up. I, cons I don't consider painting a good investment. Experts say otherwise. <clears throat> Especially during the pan, like times of crisis or like where money starts dropping, they it's always a positive thing. Okay, well, we said that's from over for rich people, really rich people. No, not even, not even a rich people thing. What's that used for? Well, it's just a replica. Only a All right, so I'm pretty it. sure this is blood already. Where's the blood one? Bloody sword. Rusty well, sword. Uh -oh. Gold, of course. And Almost then. this bastard wants to hold a gold sword. You got it. Oh, guess you're right. I mean, ima imagine finding an album of golden sword. I mean, well, if it's real gold, it's worthless. In a fight? Yeah, gold breaks pretty easy. Really? Yeah. Why do you think huh. there's not that many gold weapons? Money. Oh. Are you telling me? Oh, crap. If it was a good metal. That like people back in the Middle Ages would not like flaunt how badass they are with murdering people with a golden weapon. You know for a fact they would. All right, fair enough. Is it's, it's just very brittle against other weapons. Like, I think gold is weaker than bronze. And it's weaker than bronze, and you're fighting against people who have iron and steel. Eesh. I think even Minecraft does that. I think golden tools break the fastest. So there's no point in having the golden tools then? Yeah. Because hmm. gold is a very weak metal. Alright, where are these? It's snake and seahorse thingy. Seahorse, mm, the papa mama. The what? Leon, what are you doing? The Papa Mom. The think Papa I'm gives birth. Me? As if. Have hope. Believe. It's called a leap of faith, Ashley. Ever heard of it? Well, she does fall into Leon's Leon, are arms. You me? Jumping across chandeliers, seriously, who does that? <laughs> Where do you, my mother? I would, if I wasn't too heavy and think that the chandelier will break under my fat ass. Fair enough, fair enough. Schnickney. Because I'd love to go, like, to a gymnastic thing and tr just try even... F you know, I'm going to fail all the little tricks and stuff. But I'm too heavy. I'm going to break that... Those things. Come on. Okay. Also, I may have scared myself permanently by watching a bunch of videos of people's leg bend the wrong way when they do tricks Ooh. and stuff. Ooh, that's yeah. always worse. Yeah, I watched a bunch of videos of that, and I watched a fat guy do it, and I'm like, nope, not gonna do that. Uh-uh. Salutations, Mr. Kennedy. Hola, Salazar. Not this no. guy. Is that the speaker? Is that why you shut that? Yeah. He just makes him shut up. Ah. Uh, I thought I was, I was hoping for it would have like you, you, you know he he he'll yell. 
Yeah, I get angry at you for doing that. All right, now what's this the right way again? I don't know. You played this before, not me. All right, let me face face the thing. I know the right way. I was just commenting to myself. Ah, okay, okay. Also, I think this is the part I hate. Well. Alright, go ahead and read. What? Well, I gotta read again? I'm it's pretty sure I read most time. of it. I'm pretty sure I read most of it at the time. Uh, there are some parasites that have the ability to control their host's body. This is basic knowledge among the biologists, but not much is known as how the parasite do it. I forgot the word the. The following list of several such parasites. I am not <laughs> reading that word. Docrocomalia? One of the larvae in the parasite maggots to the ant. I already know about these <laughs> things. Why? Uh... Uh, they alter their behavior of the ant when the temperature drops in the evening during peak grazing hours. The insect ant climbs to the top of a plant and clamps on the leaf until the ma using its mandibles with the infection intention and intention of being eaten. Yes, I know that. I know that with ants, and I know that with slugs, and I know that with. I don't have to say coral, but that's not coral. Uh, gl <laughs> <laughs> you knew this was coming. Gala Sisomua? Soma? Somama? Uh, Let's say fully? No, no, you're not. <laughs> not. <laughs> Anyone who hears this, you tell me how wrong I was. <laughs> I'm not going to Google Translate. The larvae of this parasite makes their ho makes host inside the inside the brain of a fish. <clears throat> as the yellowtail. I know there's another one where it's a wasp and they sting ant no uh, tarantulas and uh, like giant uh, cockroaches. Huh? They'll sting them, and they basically turn into a vegetable, but they're still alive. And they sh they poop their larvae inside, and the larvae will eat. And they know which sections of the inside of the bug to eat to keep them alive the longest. Mm. Very disturbing. It is. Yeah. Uh, the parrot, parrot base, once infected, the fish will make its way up to the water surface where it will swim until it's eaten by seabirds. Yeah, a lot of these parasites' job is to infect something. Get, what are these <laughs> names? <laughs> Come on. Like, I don't mind. Oh, this is the snail parasite I talked about. Like, I genuinely don't mind talking about this stuff because I actually But I know the names. Yeah, but the names. Because I got to read it. I don't mind talking about it. I don't want to read it. I... Uh, Coach Lordium? This Lee Coach Lordium? I don't know. <laughs> Screw you. <laughs> it's Judge the last me. one. This parasite. What? Go on, say it. So what does CY make? Cysts. Borsitis? I, whatever. Develops in the snail's eye socket where they start glowing like rave things so they can get eaten by birds and the birds will shit on them to where slugs like to eat on other plants and the cycle continues over and over. No, Reddit. you did not read it. I just explained it in layman's terms. But you didn't read it. 
That was for volume one. You already shamed me enough. You only like reading so you could force me to read. You shut your mouth. Uh, you're the one who started reading it. You told me to. Yeah, because I read most most of it, of the rest of the chapters. Well, you never told me to read anything earlier. Well, well, I figured it, I, should, I should start making him read more. I hate you. Well, I'm gonna here leave a comment, subscribe, so I'll see us next time when we play. I just want to take a sneak peek. What's it behind here? Yep, it's that part. Oh no! Yeah, I'll see you guys next time we play Resident Evil. I hate this game.